In this video, I'm going to give you an overview of the agent and agencies dashboards. The first thing we'll need to do is log in to reach my agent. Here it is going to ask us to put in our email address and our password, and then click login. Once logged in, you'll see a drop down where you'll see an agent dashboard and an agency dashboard, provided you're an admin for the agency. You'll also get the option to view your agent profile as your clients would see it, and also account settings. From the account settings, you can change your username. You can also change your password and click update details. We're going to start by going into the agent dashboard. The first thing you'll do in the agent dashboard is click on your profile. From here, you can upload your profile picture and your profile backdrop. Clicking on the links below this video will show you how to do this. From here, you can also select your agency. You can update your email address, mobile and phone. And you can also enter a bio about yourself, which will just be displayed on your profile. You can also enter your contact information as well as a promotional video. You simply then click save. The next section is the listings. Now the listings are broken up into four sections. The first one is all listings, which is where you can see all of the properties you've listed. You can then go to unconfirmed results, which will show all of your properties that are on the market, or if they've sold, you can click confirm result and request reviews. The next one is all of your confirmed results, which is where you can request reviews again, or you can manage your reviews. You can also send a notification email automatically whenever you report a sale to the head person of your agency. The next section is the most important section. This is where you can see your pending reviews and also your completed reviews. The next section here is the widgets. Now the widgets are a great tool which links up your reviews to your personal website. You can see a preview of what that would look like. And in order to do this, all you need to do is send this code here to your web developer, and they will enter that onto your website for you, and that will forever flow through. You can also set up a social media manager. And what this does is this will allow you to send your sold results, your listed results, as well as all of your reviews across to Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn automatically. You can also schedule these to go out at a certain time each day. From here, you can also do listing reports. Now, listing reports are a great sales tool that will allow you to create a very professional, almost instant report, which you can send out to your clients. More details on this are also in the links below. You can also request a data feed. Data feeds are very important as they allow your properties to go directly into Rate Agent and be up to date at all times. And lastly, you can also see the account. All subscriptions start on basic by default and that will allow you to submit reviews, set up a data feed and also to get rankings. For more information on the standard and professional subscriptions, please click on the links below the video. I'm now going to swap to the agency dashboard. Now the agency dashboard is very similar to the agents dashboard. However, you'll notice a few new buttons. The first one you'll notice is the access button. Now the access button allows you to add more admin users and an admin user will then have access to the agency's dashboard. There's also an agents tab and this will allow you to add additional agents you can also add titles for all of your staff. Now the only difference between the widgets and the social media in this section, if you set this up, that will feed the reviews for all of your agents, not just the individual agent. And again, you can upgrade your account in here. If you upgrade it from within this section, it will apply to all agents. And as always, if you require more assistance, please click on the help button and that will take you to our support center where you can request contact with our support team. Thank you.